Hey, how you doing? My name is Clarell. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to have you see me. Um, today, I want to talk about harmony, how to do harmony, how to teach yourself harmony. Now, in the old days, of course, it was a lot easier, I'm sure, because, you know, there was a lot of street corner um, groups that was, you know, and people would, you know, vibe together and learn together. Now, we're into the me generation, you know, the selfie generation, so everybody's an individual now. Everybody's, like, by themselves, so most singers are, are soloists and how you gonna learn harmony if, if you're by yourself? Well, I'm gonna show you how to do that. Uh, I would say to use your phones, right? You know, basically harmony is um, harmony is almost like say say like if if you if you hit one note on a piano, and you're trying to find another note to go with that note that you're hitting on the piano to make it an actual chord. You know what I mean? Harmony is like it's like it's almost like um, it's either like if you're doing it a cappella, it's like creating a chord. And if you're doing it with music, then you have to listen to the music to, to, to find the notes that go with the chords that you're playing. Meaning, if I, if I hit a C, if I hit a C chord, and I go, ooh, then I have to find the harmony to go, to go along with that, ooh, you know what I mean? So what, what I would suggest you guys do is what I'm getting ready to do right now. If you're home and you're trying to find out how to sing, how to do harmony, let's let's try let's let's start some something simple. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to record record myself singing singing on hand, then I'm going to harmonize with myself. Okay, so um, let's do this. Let's go. Number one. Number two. Number three. Number four, number five, number six, seven. Okay, so let's play that back. Number one, number one, number one. Uh, I would say pick a pick a lower harmony first. It'll be easier. Um, let's play that back. If I can ever get it up. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Let's go. Number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Here's a higher one. Number five. Number six. Seven. You know what I mean? So basically what I did was at first I I I started with that with that melody. Number one, which is the melody, I went a third down from the note. Number one, and then I went a third up from the note. Number one. So meaning the chord, which 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 is like a major chord. Ah 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 ah. Which is basically a a major a major chord. You know what I mean? And that is basically how you you do harmony how you learn how to do harmony you just basically you basically duplicate whatever the chord is you know what I mean so number one which would be like the F um, number one number two number three number four you know what I mean it's all happy number one number two number three number four number one number two number three number four you know what I mean? And if you want to do an octave, number one, number two, number three, number four, which is the octave of the lowest note that I hit, okay? And that's harmony, okay? So I suggest you take your phones out or take your laptops out and do that every single day until you get it right. And you know, like have another phone, you know, like say, like you can use your phone to, to harmonize with yourself on the phone and use like a, a laptop or another phone to listen to yourself, to record yourself harmonizing with yourself on 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 the phone, on the other device, and just keep doing it every single day until it sounds perfect. And when it sounds perfect, you will be doing harmony. <laughs> okay. I hope I have helped you. If you have any comments, leave them down there or questions. I'll get back to you in a couple of days. Okay. Subscribe up top, and I'll see you soon. Take care.